Yeah, g'day there viewers, Mr. Shawnee Thompson poking along, not bad, thanks, and welcome to another episode of Shawnee in the Shed. I mean, the roof. I mean, well, you'll see. And don't forget, if you like my stuff, subscribe. Yeah, g'day there viewers, happy Saturday. I'm doing renos on the house and I have no idea how to cut this stupid corner stuff. I think I've got it right now. Hmm. The bloke who designed this stuff is a wanker! One, two, three, four, five, six. About to do number seven attempt at getting this right. Mate, I've got three tubes and no more gaps here, mate. On the next cut, if it's not right, I'm just going to fill the bastard up with no more gaps and send her. Got him, bro. Bit of no more gaps in there and send her. And only half a tube and no more gaps, baby. Winning. You want to know one of the best things about being a bit of a social media influencer? Is it the people's willingness to help you? I've had like six people say to me, I'll come around and give you a hand throwing that bit of corner stuff, Shawnee. One bloke even off to drive like two and a half hours from Tamworth to come over and help with the corners. You must be doing something right if people are willing to do that for you. Now let's go nails and stuff. Oh, it doesn't work. Battery must be flat. Why do I keep doing this to myself? Everybody knows I hate getting electrocuted. The light circuit's off. I mean on, so that must mean I did turn the power circuit off. Shit, I hope so. I'm trying to fix this hole in the wall. There's a power point there. Someone said I should just turn all the mains off one time, like before when I electrocuted, but like, where's the fun in that? It's heaps more fun figuring out whether I did it or not, eh? I love a little <laughs> in the afternoon, Saturday afternoon. <laughs> so far, so good. Let's just check something real quick. <laughs> nah, got him turned off. Yeah, <laughs> scared you, but didn't I? So, I've got the power off because of that. And I need to go and use a circular saw to cut a little bit more strip off the side. So do I leave that wire sticking out of the wall and turn the power back on and just use the circular saw? I hope the shit the house doesn't burn down or do I um, put the power point back in there? Um, decisions, decisions. Honey, is there a fire inside? Excellent. Now all you guys, you guys know that I'm a Milwaukee man true and true. I went and stole myself one of these Dewalt nail guns. I know it hurt my soul. But this thing has got rapid fire on it. Ready? That is really cool. So it turns out that um, I'm a mechanic and all my holes are pre-drilled, right? I just put bolts in and I've cut that the wrong way. So the power point, it's going to sit like that. Well, that was silly, wasn't it, hey? Not bad, thanks. So I think one of my nails has got the, um, it's got the power, look. Oh, that's not good, hey? Can you see that? <laughs> Shit! So I'm up in the roof again. I feel like I should make like a little man cave up here. I feel like I spend a lot of time up here. And I'm dealing with the wiring. I gotta pull that cord there out. And it's definitely stuck on a nail. A nail has gone through it. I got the power off. I oh, know, right? I should left it on. Heaps more fun. I don't know what to do. The bloody supervisor and the executive director want to get up. You want to come up here? Yeah. What for? It's good? Yeah, we want to get up there. Righto, hang on. Yeah, that's for the air conditioning. You two right? Yeah. Now, there's a rat up in here somewhere, a mouse or something. You girls yeah. want to catch him? Yeah. Righto. Now, remember the rules. 
We don't step on this one. We only step on these ones, okay? Okay. Okay. Dead. Yeah, the, pretend this one's fire, so we can't step on them ones, okay? Dead. Yeah. Dead. Yep. Go, Mo. You're doing well. The supervisor's on the job. Go, go, go. And remember, people the power's off, so no, they can't get hurt. I hope it's a rat anyway. <laughs> oh, Mummy's coming too. Come on in, woman. Get up in here. The whole family affair. We might as well just make a little room up in here. Mom, hey? Like what do you reckon? Down. So the kids bailed and left me. Little buggers. I'm following the big rat bob myself. So for all you sparkies having a bit of a giggle at me at the moment, absolutely sensational. So basically what's happened is the nail has gone through one of those two wires. That one there's my big oven wire. One of those two, they go down to the power point. They join up inside the behind the power point and they come back up to the wall, up through the wall. And then that one there goes around over there somewhere and that one there goes to the next power point along in the system. So what I'm trying to do is use this bit of timber to lever up on the wire to try and prise it out of the nail. It's not working. Any other ideas would be sensational right about now. Might phone a friend and see what he'd do. So I just phoned a friend, he said pull the nail out of the wall and then the cable will come up. Well I can't get the nail out of the wall because it's like gone so far in because of the nail gun and you saw me yesterday, ding 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 ding, I don't know which nail it is. No, sorry for swearing mum bear, I love you. I'm running out of options people. So the other option he said was just cut the cord, cut it down the power point, run new cord down. But I can't do that either because... There's no room to run another cord down in that tiny little hole. How about I just burn the house down and buy a new one? That's where I'm at at the moment. Not bad, thanks. Oh, this is fun. I love Renos, eh? I'm having a ball. Okay, so here's what I'm doing, what I'm trying to do. I've got the bit of cord that I'm trying to pull out. I brought it up to this piece of timber, wrapped it around the piece of timber, I've got it on there, and I've got this end, my leg. I'm using it as this is like a big lever. Try and pull it out of the hole. And it's really hard to do it while you're holding your phone. I'll let you know how I go. I got one out. Look, 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 look. There's the bitey end. Don't touch the bitey end. Now, this one, I've just resorted to doing this. Come on, buddy. You can do it. Come on. Come on, man. Just, just go out. Damn it, fool. I have a newfound respect for house electricians. I really do. You guys are fucking legends. Sorry for swearing. But you guys are legends. When I become rich and famous, I mean, I'm already kind of famous, but when I become rich from being famous, um, I'm probably still going to do dumb stuff like this because it's fun. So I got the second one. I'm so excited, but I can't see where the nail went through it. I'm thinking because there's like so much conduit gone from there. I think it must have been like right down there, right, right where the power point comes out of the wall. But that's all good, so now I've just got to feed some new cable down there and happy days. No, Dad. So after much deliberations, expectations and salutations, I don't even know what that means. It's fixed. And look, it works. Yeah, coffee. I'm going to build it now, check out my pencil. So we've been working hard all day, so it's time to play in the sand pit. Quick stub stuff with kids. We're building a pirate castle, aren't we, Mui? Yeah. Yeah, pirate castle's in the sand pit. Yeah, yeah get out of your viewers. Happy Sunday. Do you guys want to see something cool? Of course you want to see something cool. This here is the table saw of death. Yes, it's a homemade table saw. I acquired it. If you pull this little lever here and lift this up here, See the saw pops out? I don't know. It's... See that? It is so, so sketchy. But it works really well. It's um all homemade. It's like got a, a motor there, a little belt thing there. And it's all like the weight of the motor puts the tension on the belt. It's so sketchy. It even works. It vibrates and shakes and rattles and bangs and clangs. I love it. It's like an adrenaline rush every time you do something. <laughs> Smuggo! Nothing beats. 87 cent scotchies from Aldi. Cut the caps of Milo. Cut 
cappuccino for me, coffee for wifey. Mate, did you get any paint on the walls at all? There you go. For anyone who doesn't believe me, I'm a legit builder, hey. Like, check out my pencil. It's a proper building pencil. Bought at Bunnings for two bucks. So I'm putting my building pencil down, people. Back to electrics again. This light switch turns off that light. Well, it used to turn that light off. Are you sure that's the switch for that light, lovey? Mm -hmm. Are you sure? Yes. We've only lived here 10 years. 10 years? Eight years. A long time anyway. It's broken. But that's all right. I have a new one. Look at him, isn't he adorable? He's gonna look good right there. Oh, it's a bit longer. Oh, now that sounds like it works better. Now, first things first, turn the power off before you go, oh, nah, too late. Oh well, we'll see what happens. You're gonna need a little screwdriver. This is like a Shawnee's tutorial on how to change a light switch. Live, baby. I oh, know, get your little screwdriver. In here, behind here. Did you turn the power off? No, I did not turn the power off. Now that one there is live. That's like the always live one. That one there is the switch wire, so it sends power up to the light once you flick the switch. So that one there, you gotta undo that. That there. Oh, look at me go one handed holding a phone. Not bad, thanks. Oh my god, it gets sapped. It's gonna hurt so. Ah! flick it. Alright, so undo that one. And watch. See, you pull it out and it got like go, I mean, pull it out. The thingy, and the light goes off. Remember. That there love power, baby. Don't touch the body end. Because it goes. Okay. Big switch off. It got the better of me. I really, really hate getting electrocuted. Just hurts. So, next step, undo that one there, but make sure there's no power. To check if there's no power, Get your screwdriver. Whoop, can you all see that? And just, just tap it on there, rule, and then touch that metal thing that's hanging on the wall. And <laughs> nah, got me. Undo that one, and then we'll get back to you. And then what you're going to want to do is you want to get your white one, or your red one per se, stick it in the middle aisle there. Now well, that's out of focus. And then, ooh, and then get your white one and stick him in there. In that one there. Got me? Got me. And hopefully it works. Hopefully. Hmm. Hmm. Yep. Hmm. Hmm. Something is not white. Hmm. Turn the power back off again. Swap the wires from. I don't know. So I put the wire in there and I put the wire over there and then... It should work. I eat like that. Eureka! Oop. No, thank you! Great success! Next job. Got him. That is not straight, hey. Oh, good. Oh. Winning. Why is it zapping? I don't know. Is it zapping? No. Try it. See what happens. No. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. I don't want to get zapped either. Turn the light on. No, You're never going to turn that light on again, are you, lovey? <laughs> I'm going back to being a builder. Electrics is hard. I mean, what in the cousin loving back straight to the black stump is going on up there? I don't know. I did it. <laughs> Got me. Not bad, thanks. That was wholly wicked. <laughs>